Owe me a coffee, asshole! You were right. The arms dealer is after Victoria. I need to stop him before he gets too close. Man, he already too close. You want my advice? You take that girl and you run. I never did believe in running. According to my sources, the girl is in Chicago. Me and the boys are leaving ASAP. I need you along to spearhead the operation. Are you in? Wait. I heard you. You want me to snatch some chick? Her name's Victoria. Dom is gonna call you, tell you how to find her. She's in hiding somewhere. You got that? That's a lot of hassle for one chick. She must be special. I need to bring my boys. That means double my fee. Mm. Take Lenny with you. He can bring her back when you find her. Lenny, limp dick? Trip on my fee. <laughs> Sorry, the kid's a dipshit. 25. 39. 26. 37. 30. 35. Deal. <laughs> Lenny, come give the man a line. <laughs> Come on, Limp Dick. <laughs> Limp Dick Lenny. <laughs> Shut up, Wade! <laughs> I like good old Wade, I really do. Son of a bitch makes my skin crawl. Oh, that's probably why I like him. <laughs> now, Blake Dex is a ruthless son of a bitch for sure, but the guy you really need to worry about is his business partner, Dom Osman, owner of the Vixen Club over on Bristol Street. This prank is bad new homes, even by my standards. I mean, he's clever and really connected. And it's only a matter of time before he tracks down your girl at the orphanage. How do you know about that? Hey, Chicago knows, I know. <laughs> Dom ain't all that different. Send me his picture. Now, since every cop in Chicago is hot on your ass, safest route to the Vixen Club should be through the tunnels next to the Roxy. Good luck, Holmes.
Hey, it's me. I uh, heard something strange and you're checking on it. Over. Chicago's finest. You're always welcome. Hey, it's me. Yeah, you can put your seat back up. What are you, special? You want to see some titties? You gotta pay. Oh, come on, man. How you doing, Hank officer? Knows me. Hank always comps my entrance. Come on. Hank here? You know Hank? Hank knows me. I don't now know. remember, when you get inside the Vixen Club, look toward the bar. Cause Dom is healing. to shake that ass for me. Smoked salmon, Wade's really into that. Only the best for my buddies, right? <laughs> Sweet. Tap you later, baby. his friends I'd be going to Hawaii hey hey look you just got to entertain his friends don't let them think they own you and just 
Think of something positive. We... We've all been there, honey. Luckily, they don't ask twice. <laughs> just tell me, what happens in Hawaii? I mean, it's just... You, know, you all say it's really bad. I mean, is it... Is it just like a private club? You know, like the back room? Yeah. Something like that. But... It's... It's not something you... Really want to be a member of. Just... Just be strong, baby. Yeah, pretty girl. You show them how good you are, but just don't say yes to everything they say. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. I won't. I won't. <sighs> poor, 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 poor thing. Yeah. Well, I'm flattered. And you don't look half bad. All right, well, what do you say to you and me? A bottle of tequila and... Uh, yeah, okay, freak scene. Okay, that was the lamest flash mob I've ever seen. Yeah, that was awesome. I'm hot. Hmm, okay, that was not awesome. Hey, step off! You no, know, I got pepper spray and I know how to use it. Will you stop? I'm gonna get the police. You were right. Dom was searching for Victoria. I got to him just in time. Good for you, Holmes. Kudos. He was on to you as well. A man is coming. A man named Wade. That guy's crazier than a shithouse rat. You need to get your ass over here right away, because this is about to get very loud and very messy. I have to call you back.
Bertie, I'm on my way back to Chinatown. Stay low and watch your back. Oh, yeah? Well, that's easy for you to say, Holmes. Man, that Wade, they say he got ways to make you talk. And you and I both know that I got a lot of shit to say, so hurry! Just stay calm. You're not looking in the right place. Duh, duh. I'm not a fucking idiot. If I was looking in the right place, we could go home. The thing I can't find. Will you fucking stop talking like that? But that is my voice. I can't help it. Are you okay? You know what? Should have asked. See me. You gotta get me out of here, Holmes. You got to. You got to. For your own damn good. Bertie, focus. Don't do anything foolish. I will take care of this. Thank you. 
Dispatch, I've got a disturbance. I can't be sure. Looking into it. No. Much obliged. Come on. I have baskets full of them. I'll give you a good deal on. Come on. If I was to say Birdie, then you would respond, what? Uh, you want roast duck? Wrong answer. <clears throat> okay, asshole, here we go. Once more for the hearing impaired. Where's the guy they call Birdie? And what about that bald son of a bitch, huh? Start talking. Please, I don't know about any Birdie. Ah, <sighs> shit. Okay, I'm gonna count down from ten. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Ah, oh, shit, the hell with this. I got a table at the Vixen.
everyone. Chicago police, please come forward. Dispatch, I have a lead on the perp. Investigating with caution. Birdie, where is he? You owe me a coffee, asshole! Hmm. He left with this cowboy guy. Real nasty looking piece of work. They were going downtown, I think. I gotta do what I gotta do. <laughs> Tell me, Mr. Wade, what would you rather do? Find a girl? Or waste a bullet? Clock is ticking. <laughs>